I think I want to be remembered, first of all, as a God-fearing man. Sometimes I'll be known as someone that might have been a little bit of a pain to get along with, but I don't think there's anybody that can't say that I didn't show them love. How about you? (laughs) I want to be remembered as a hard worker. I want to show people that I care and treat everyone with kindness and respect because we all deserve that. When you think about the future, what are you most scared of and what are you most hopeful for? Uh, I think what I'm most scared of are my grand youngins and what they may have to deal with in the future. Nuclear war, our resources being depleted. What I'm most afraid of is that we'll keep getting divided, but all wrapped in that, I'm hopeful because you and I come from you know, maybe different backgrounds and maybe different political views and maybe different religious views, but none of that has ever stopped us from being a family. If we still lived in the circumstances from years ago or the way things were years ago, we would probably never know each other. Mm -hmm. There were some things that I taught when I was a young man that would have never allowed us to even have a conversation. Mm -hmm. But I thank God that he gave me the knowledge to understand what love really means. Does it bother you that we don't agree about politics? No, it doesn't bother me. Being different shows us the different sides of things. We may differ in a lot of things, but we agree in a lot of things, and I think we listen to each other in a lot of things. You're precious to me. (laughs) You really are. 